Hello, welcome to Storytime. Today we're reading Little Dino Says Please by Kate Melton. It was a bright morning in Dinosaur Town, but Donnie the Dino was feeling quite down. He looked all around and then gave a big groan. I can't find my friends. I'm all on my own. What's up, said a butterfly fluttering by. You seem quite upset. Do you want to say why? Donnie looked up and then answered, I'm bored. My friends are all playing and I feel ignored. They said that at times I can be rather rude, like when I snatch toys or I eat all their food. So Butterfly rested on Donnie's clutched hand. You might need a trip in a magical land. A magical land, he asked, tempted to tease. Sure, she said, and this land is called Please. Please, he replied with incredulous eyes. If you don't believe me, just give it a try. You look at someone with a smile on your face and say the word please with some kindness and grace. People will listen to every request and this boring day will sure change for the best. And right after that, she leaped up and was gone. Donnie, confused, just kept walking on. He saw his friends Malcolm, Miguel, and Louise. Can I play with you guys? And then he added, please? Yes, said his friends, and the four played all day until it was time to be back on their way. Donnie got home and he opened the gate. His sister was there. She was riding her skate. He watched how she glided with grace and with ease. Can I try? questioned Donnie. And then he said, please? Okay, she replied, and she helped him to skate. They played and they laughed right until it got late. That night, Mommy hugged him and kissed his round head. My dear little dino, it's now time for bed. Not yet, answered Donnie. I'd like one more book. Please, he then said with a very cute look. But just halfway through it, he drifted away, so tired from his wonderful, magical day.